Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing Ember from Disney Pixar's Elemental. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's first start off by zooming in on the head. In the center, let's start with an upside down V for the nose. Now on the left, let's leave a gap and let's draw an angled curve up. And the same thing on the right side. And now let's close off the bottom of each eye with a curve. Next, inside each eye, let's draw a circle a little bit towards the center. And then inside, let's draw another circle. And now let's color both of these in black. Next, above each eye, let's draw a curve down above the center. Now for the end, a small curve down. And now let's add two more curved points to close it off. And that's it for the eyes. Next, let's move up and draw the eyebrows. Above each eye, let's draw a large curve. And then let's add another curve on top. Now let's hop down and draw the mouth. We'll start with a curve and bring it up on the right. And that's it for the face. Next, let's draw the shape of the head. We'll start right next to the eye and let's draw an S-shaped curve up like this. And the same on the right. Now from the bottom, let's draw a small curve out. Now let's bring it down with an S-shape. And then for both ends, let's angle it towards the center. Leaving a small gap in the middle. Now let's curve it down from both sides for the neck. And close it off with a small V-shape. Now let's hop back up and draw the top of the head. From the left side, let's draw a flame going up and back down. And then from the right, let's draw a wavy one up and down. And then for the middle piece, let's draw a small point up on the left then bring it up with two curves and back down. And now let's add some small flame details. On the left side, let's draw a wavy one here. One above it. And then one more on the right. 
And that's it for the head. Next, let's move down and draw the body. Next to the neck, let's start by adding the collar. Let's draw a curve out and then bring it in. And the same on the right. Next, let's hop down and let's draw two curves down for the sides of the torso. And then curve lines down for the sleeves of her dress. Now at the bottom, let's add the belt with two curves. Now underneath, let's draw the bottom of her dress. From the left side, let's bring it out and then curve it down. And let's do the same thing on the right. And now let's close off the bottom with a curve across. And that's it for her dress. Now let's move back up and draw her arms. On the left side of her collar, let's start with a flame up and down. Now let's curve it down and then add another pointed flame underneath. Then another curve. Then a bump up and back down. And now let's curve it down and then bring it back up into the skirt. And now add a diagonal line for the inside of the arm. And lastly for the side, let's add another flame floating outside with an S-shaped curve like this. And that's it for the left arm. Next let's hop over and draw the right side. Again, let's start by drawing three pointed flames up and down like this. And then let's add one more up going the other way and back down. Now let's curve her arm downwards. Let's draw an S-shaped curve down and curve it back up at the end. Now from the end, let's curve it back down into the skirt. And then let's follow that same curve inside for the other side of the arm. And lastly, on top of the arm, let's draw another small flame like this. And that's it for the arms. Next, let's move down and draw the legs. Let's start underneath the skirt in the middle and let's draw two curved lines down going the opposite directions. And then another set of angles curves. Now let's hop to the outside. Let's draw an S-shaped curve down on both sides. Then dip it down and out. Now from the outside line, let's draw a long curve down. And then a wavy line from the inside coming down to a point. And that's it for Ember, now let's quickly color her in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me, and please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching!